Not very strong, but it's there. 9996, the uh, RWM Moscow time signal. On this 80s vintage radio, Panasonic. Not the best in the world, but uh, does the job still, you know. I uh, had one of those. And back then, my knowledge wasn't good enough to really assess how good it was. I had uh, other radios. I had the DX302 at the time. Realistic DX302. I had a DX100. I also had a Panasonic uh, RF 2200, 2800. It's a portable. And it was with a red LED display. And all were drifting. I mean, back in the days, the PLL driven radios were not there yet. I mean, phase lock loop appeared sometime in the 80s as a standard for some radios, mostly the higher and more expensive ones. But the bottom ones were still, you know, kind of just analog style radios that would have drifting. And this radio, of course, is no exception. It drifts a lot. I have to readjust all the time. And uh, funny thing, or well, funny story about it, I, you know, RWM time signal existed in the 80s, yet it wasn't until late in the 90s, if not early 2000, that I've received this for the first time ever. Yet, uh, when it interferes with WWV, I kind of noticed that it probably was like that and I did receive RWM without even knowing about it back then in the 80s. But now with the more extensive knowledge, you know, kind of know what you're receiving on the radio or not. So 9996 or 9997 lower sideband RWM time signal pips here.